What's going on guys? Welcome back to another My Faction video and it's the month of September, which means we got a ton of content to go over. So without further ado, let's just get it right into it because we got pink diamonds. We got some new diamond rewards. It's crazy, man. Pink diamond here is literally about to release, guys. We are finally heading over and transitioning over into the pink diamond tier. But let's go ahead and actually showcase everything that we have to offer today. All right, so starting off with Faction Wars because we did showcase this already. So I did showcase this in a video the last week, but um, if you guys missed it, here we have it. We have some new Faction Wars bosses for 8,000 Faction Wars credits, which isn't bad. Uh, I definitely wonder what the prices are gonna be for the pink diamond cards when we eventually get them because you know, this, that's actually not too bad. Obviously you have to get the bosses as well, but unfortunately the bosses, their badges are not the best. You know, these cards are, you know, they're decent cards, but they're nothing that's gonna be groundbreaking in my faction. <laughs> they're not. So, you know, let me know if you guys do plan on picking them up or are you guys just gonna be saving for, you know, Pink Diamond Galaxy Opal tier bosses, you know? I definitely wanna know. I know we got some more Amethyst ones as well, which is really cool as well. So, you know, just going over a, a few of them. I think we already had this one. But um, yeah, it's really nice. You know, I'll definitely take new bosses as always. And um, hopefully, like I said, we can get some better badges for the future bosses that we get in the future. We also got some Amethyst rewards for the rotating cards as well. And these rotating cards don't seem too bad. Wow, look at that. We got Luke Gallows, Ricochet, Carmella, and Bailey. So that's really cool. Bailey, obviously Bailey has a great moveset and stuff. I'm gonna just showcase the stats right here. Hopefully the badges, ah, hopefully the badges are gonna be better. But yes, I mean, it's cool for Amethyst card. Uh, this will work. This will definitely work. Carmella is another great card with a great moveset. And hey, badges are pretty decent. This is actually... So far, a good looking card off rip. Really nice. Let's see, Ricochet as well. Okay, pretty decent. And Luke Gallows. Uh, yeah, pretty decent. Okay, yeah. So, hey, you know, these cards for the rotating cards definitely aren't that bad. Um, if you guys wanted to know my opinion, I would definitely go for Carmella first and probably Luke Gallows and then Bailey and then Ricochet. So, yeah, really nice stuff here in Faction Wars. But obviously, we still are waiting for some more updates. And um, hopefully, the NWO glitch doesn't keep coming back and going away coming back going away so hopefully we can just have a stable faction wars for the rest of the game's life cycle and we obviously have some new live events as well and here are the live events that are currently going live right now and we also have this new one right here which looks really cool i am <laughs> definitely i am definitely going to be going for this as well we have 30 days worth of it too so yeah i am definitely going to be going after this this is going to be really cool we get a pack tons of tokens tons of mfp and some cool other other cosmetics and stuff so yeah, i'm definitely going to be going for it let me know what you guys got from the bash in berlin pack as well the tokens are definitely going to be needed because what i'm going to talk about later on in this video so we got some new live events as well guys so this is gonna be really cool. Obviously, we got some, some you know, created superstars. Uh, the obviously the, but the stats on the created superstars are a bit weird. I don't know why. I don't know why they're like that. The stats, but all right, it's cool. But badges, they seem decent as well. I mean, hey, if you guys need a woman's card that's gonna be a diamond, hey, might as well get it. All you need is a silver Liv Morgan, and that goes live tomorrow. So that's really cool, guys. So let me know what you guys think about that right here in the comment section down below. So that's going to be pretty decent as well. Oh, and she has Rage as her ability. Okay, hey. Will that card make my squad? Probably not, but I definitely want to check the moveset out for sure. See, hey, you know what she has to offer. Wait a minute. Oh, wait. So we got Doink the Clown from Fashion Wars, the bosses, and now you can get them in here <laughs> from the live events tab. Okay, uh, let's see. Finisher seems pretty cool. Pin Escape is... All right, all right, pretty okay badges. I mean, it's nothing too crazy. Oh, wow, he does have better badges, though. All right, hey, that's definitely left up to you guys if you guys think that you guys want to go for it. Um, obviously, you're going to have to get lucky with Faction Wars bosses. I'm not too sure how long that this card will stay in the live events tab, but if he stays in long enough, you can definitely try to get your hands on him for sure. So, hey, if you, if you guys can't get your hands on him, Hey, might as well do it. I say, yeah, go ahead and go for it. That just seemed pretty good. Next up, we got a Persona Macho Man Randy Savage Slim Jim. Oh, we got a Slim Jim crossover, which is really cool. <laughs> so that's really cool. Persona card. And all you need is a Superstar Series 2 LA Knight. So that's really cool. And you can probably pick them up off of the auction house or the, the card market. Um, if 
Is he? Yeah, yeah, he should be able to, have, you know, for an affordable price. So that's pretty cool. But um, yeah, Macho Man, Randy Savage, obviously he has a great moveset. Obviously, I'm, I'm not even too worried about his stats, but his badges. Badges are actually nice. Wow. Okay, yeah. This is definitely a cool card to have for sure. Okay, yeah. Hey, this is definitely a nice card. I definitely think that you guys will enjoy this card if you go for it. So, hey, that's a really nice card. If you guys have LA Knight, you're good to go all for it, man. Next up, we have a Shawn Michaels event featuring Eddie Guerrero, 97. Oh, man. Eddie Guerrero's moveset's already nice. Oh, my gosh. Look at that movement speed. Look at the movement speed, the stamina, the pin escape. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, this is this is a definitely a nice card. I know a lot of you guys are going to have fun with this card as well. And uh, badges are pretty cool they're you know they're okay in some set of, you know categories but it, it can work it can work it's eddie guerrero you can make it work i'm not even too worried about that and resiliency as his ability which is awesome we also have a diamond Phil finn balor featuring Liv morgan with the card requirement as well we just got a finn balor card too so hey i guess we're gonna get another one then and he has pretty good stats as well and badges oh badges are definitely good too badges are definitely good so this is so we're starting to get some really nice diamond cards as well but you're definitely gonna have to have certain cards in order to go for them so let me know do you guys qualify for any for any of these cards so far i definitely want to know and then obviously we got the Sami Zayn one as well that we went over the other day we also have a pink diamond becky lynch and you need token market Liv morgan <laughs> So that goes live in 14 days. Literally do whatever you guys can to get tokens. I might have another video on it because you guys definitely need to get these tokens in order to get this Becky Lynch card. So I'm at 380 tokens right now. I'm just trying to save up my tokens so I can get out of Ruby tier and then bam, we'll be in Amethyst tier, but we're definitely gonna need to make that work. So whew, that's gonna be a little bit crazy, but let me know, did, if, is it <laughs> is anybody in the, the Amethyst tier? I know some of you guys are. And if you are, let me know. Did you guys get Liv Morgan? Uh, you know what suck? What would suck if before you guys saw this live event, if someone bought, you know, a different Amethyst card, and then there's like, oh shoot, now I need another. <laughs> I know I need another batch of tokens. So dang, that's crazy. But here we have it: Becky Lynch, 95 overall. We're back. We're, hey, we're finally starting to get into Pink Diamond tier, man. And um, you know, here's the thing: this tier is definitely going to determine. Whether or not if I'm going to go cash out on it or if I'm going to just save my MFP until Galaxy Opal's here. I mean, we'll, we'll see. We'll see. I'm not going to think too far ahead. We'll see when the Galaxy Opal tier releases. But I definitely see, are the badges going to be worth it? Are these badges going to look like Pink Diamond badges or are they just going to look kind of mediocre? Let's see. Overall, stats-wise, they look pretty good. Pretty good on defense as well. Oh, Pin Escape a 90 as well. Finisher a 90. Okay, not too bad. There you go. These are the type of stats I want to see, right? The badges I want to see right here. Going in hot on gold. Steam like a be on Hall of Fame. Space Invader. Yeah, we got some really nice stuff. Always see it coming. Yeah, I really like the badges that she has. So this is definitely a great card to have for sure. And it is de definitely Jack approved. If I can get my hands on it, I will definitely try my best. Hopefully this live event stays live for a good minute because I would hate for it to only last a couple of days. And it's like, oh, well, I guess I guess I can't participate in it. So really cool. I'm definitely excited for that event. And next up, oh, my gosh, this right here, this right here is going to be cheesy. You guys know, I think Dominic Mysterio's moveset in this game is super cheesy. He's one of the best cards in the game, in my opinion, of every tier. He's not going to fail to disappoint, I'm assuming, in Pink Diamond tier. So you need a Bastion Berlin Liv Morgan Diamond card as well in order to participate in this event. It goes live in 21 days, so there is a chance that you might be able to pull her, you might be able to get her from the car market, you know what I'm saying? So will that be worth the investment? We will see, but let's see how his stats and badges are looking like in order to see, hey, should we go for it or not? So obviously he has a really nice moveset. I don't even need to talk about his, his stats. I mean, stats wise... They're really nice as well. Man, he's fast. Wow, you're definitely gonna be able to do some work with this card. Oh man, oh wait, wait, wait. Oh yeah, he does have Sting Like a B. Okay, he has Sting Like a B on Hall of Fame. I'll take it. All right, all right, all right. It would have been nice if he had Rebel Rouser because most of his cards do have Rebel Rouser. This one doesn't, but he has Wet Blanket, which is really nice. So hey, definitely a cool card as well. I don't think that he is a must have though when it comes to badges and stuff though. He is a good card, but Obviously, with the stat, the badges that we get for our diamond cards already, 
I think that we could have definitely gotten some a little bit better with when it comes to this one, but it's still really nice. And resiliency as his ability, which is awesome. But that seems to be it for today, guys. Let me know what you guys think about all the new live events, Faction Wars bosses, all the huge updates that we got in my faction today, guys. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. I will be responding to you guys as well. And yeah, I'm definitely going to be grinding for some more tokens. I really hope I can go for this live morgan i definitely want to go for this banking lynch card so we have 14 days to do so hopefully we get some more live events that feature you know a ton of tokens just like this one as well so make sure you guys stay tuned to the channel i will keep you guys updated on my progression as well and give you guys some tips and tricks on how you guys can get some more tokens as well guys thank you guys so much for watching hit that like button subscribe to the channel if you guys are new i'll see you guys on the next my faction video i'm signing out peace